From an epic warm film to a laugh out loud comedy, get ready for a big weekend at the movies. Ron Van Timmerman from Celebration Cinema <laughs> here is to talk to about talk about the box office buzz. Right. All right, so we're going to talk about 1917, the movie. Yeah. I wanted to see it before the Glo Golden Globes. I know you know it's, right. it's coming out this weekend, um, but now I want to see it even more after. Oh that. yeah, it's going to get the Oscar bump on Monday oh. too when the Oscar nominations come out. Uh, really a terrific movie. If you like movies like Saving Private Ryan or Dunkirk, we're going back to World War I. And you know what? They had to get a message to the front. And they, they don't have cell phones, right? They right. don't have computers. They don't have any of that. They got to send guys, right? Mm -hmm. Two guys through this worst of the war to deliver a message that will save 1,600 lives. And the gimmick here that I loved is it plays out in real time when you watch this movie. So oh my the, the gosh. clock is ticking, the suspense is there, uh, great characters and performances here, uh, but it's rated R for war stuff. You sure, know? but I do love that real time element. Boy, that's gonna get your heart racing while you're watching it. Yeah, good stuff. Yeah, mm -hmm. and then we have Just Mercy. Yeah, true story here. We're gonna get Michael B. Jordan and uh, Jamie Foxx, Foxx accused of killing a white girl, sent to death row for a crime he didn't commit. Michael B. Jordan's gonna defend him. Brie Larson is gonna assist him. True story of a guy that literally has spent his whole career uh, uh, freeing death row inmates wow. that were uh, falsely accused. So you're gonna, this is in the 80s, you know, recent history here. Uh, but you're gonna get uh, you know a lot of courtroom drama as well as some civil rights uh, lessons here. But that's rated PG-13, certified fresh, uh, definitely a must-see. Mm, it sounds like it. All right, and then we have Like a Boss, and I have been seeing previews for this all week long, and I can tell you, I just wanna go see this and have a good laugh. It's an R-rated laugh, don't, uh, <laughs> don't kid yourself. It's a raunchy comedy, like a bridesmaid or a night school, and you see the blonde Rose, uh, Rose Byrne, Tiffany Haddish, the, the ginger Selma Hayek, what's with that hair? I know, I thought the same thing when I saw that ginger hair. <laughs> and they're in a, the fashion business, or the beauty products, uh, Selma's their rival. Uh, and, uh, you know, so the comedy ensues. And again, just be ready for some <laughs> R-rated stuff in, in Like a Boss Go in with the right mindset right. and you might have a good laugh. Yes. All right. Up, uh, next week, we're moving on. Bad right. Boys for Life. Bad Boys for Life. Will Smith, Martin Lawrence is back. The action, everything is all, well, let's take a look. I'm putting you on a new team. You're working with Ammo now. Cap, Ammo is a high school musical boy band with guns. You look great, Grandpa. So you're that guy. There's always one. Right up till there's not. That's what I like, teamwork. I'm the definition of half man, half drugs. That's the drugs, bad boy, that's the stuff. Marcus. All right, they're uh, back, right? R-rated action, witty repartee. Joey Pants in there, Vanessa Hudgens. Uh, you know, big $90 million budget here, and good to see Will Smith back in these kind of roles. They, they're great commercial movies. Is it like the, the old bad boys? Oh, yeah. Yeah? Yeah, very much so. And okay. they were R-rated hits back right. in the day. So uh, we're looking for a big one again next weekend. And then we have... Dr. Doolittle, bring the baby. Uh, Doolittle, not the doctor. <gasps> Although, you know, the storyline, all they'll tell me is a physician discovers he can talk to animals, okay? <laughs> and then we're going to go on an but adventure. But he's not a doctor. No, right. He's a physician. <laughs> he's got some interesting characters playing these animals. He's a little dark, even. Well, it's PG. Okay. Uh, there's going to be some, you know, peril, I'm sure, uh, and a, a lot of fun. I mean, right. if you liked Lion King this summer, this is what it reminds me of. So, you know, bring the kids. It's going to be just fine. All right. Thanks so much, Ron. Of course, we put all this information on tickets and showtimes on our website, 13onyourside.com. Have a great weekend. Stay safe, and we will see you right back here on Monday.